Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. So here is yet again another haul. I normally don't have this many hauls in one month, but there were so many good deals. This will be the last one for April because I'm pretty stocked up and way under budget yet. So let's get started. Uh, today I went to Walmart and I spent $60.18, rounded up to $16.20, and, $60 and, and I'll show you what I got. So the first things that I got were these butter, they were $2.97 each, and that is the cheapest I have ever found butter in a really, really long time. Uh, then I got these red kidney beans, and I do believe... These were $2.57. I wanted to make some chili and I don't have any of these beans. So this will make a lot of beans though as well because they're dried. And then I found these lean beef, ground beef and pork tubes. These were on clearance and they were $2 each. And that is a really good deal for ground pork and beef. And then I got these uh, bags of clearance pears and then there's some uh, baby mandarins in here and yeah there was uh, one more pear but we ate it already and I know they look really bad but they are just really ripe and they are really tasty right now and these ones are still firmer but uh, they are still really good to eat and I might just cut these ones up and Freeze them, and these two are good to eat fresh, though. And then I can use these ones in my smoothies. And we really have been eating a lot of oranges lately, so that's why I got those extra ones. And all of that for $2. And then in this here's bag, we got a papaya, which we haven't had in a really long time. And then I got a tiny little... Uh, mango, I can't remember the name for these kinds, but uh, uh, we haven't had mango in a while either. And this really large lemon. I love lemon, and a, you can never have too much lemon. So that was also $2 for all of that. And then I found these really, uh, these baguettes, and they're still really fresh. And they went down to 52 cents each, so I'll probably end up freezing those. And we can eat those when I make pasta or whatever. And then I don't buy chips a lot, but uh, since this month I've been so under budget, I bought the No Name Value, and they were 97 cents each. And as you can see, Isabel has already eaten some of the all dress kind and which are her favorite and then we got a sour cream as well and I got a ginger ale which was also 97 cents we or I love ginger ale personally I don't buy a lot of pop uh, but when I do it's normally ginger ale sometimes I'll buy coke or Pepsi because my husband likes it and so does Isabel. Anyway, these are one of the best deals I found this time. These were each 50 cents, so I got six in total. So there were three dollars for all of these. That I thought was such a really great deal. I never buy them, but I figured I would give it a go since they were so cheap. And the cheese was also on sale. I haven't had cheese now in a couple months. So these were $3.97 for each brick. I also found some yogurt on clearance. And this was this whole tub was $1.25. <coughs> Excuse me. And I found some more clearance items, some blueberry muffins. I normally do not buy this kind of stuff, but again, it was for such a good price, I decided why not. Those were 70 cents, and then I also found some of these sugar mini donuts for 70 cents, and as you can see, they've already been nibbled on, as well as these chocolate glazed mini donuts. 
Those have also been nibbled on as well. So those were all 70 cents. And then I bought more sour cream for $1.38. That is a really good price for sour cream and we really like our sour cream in this house. And then I got another one for $1.23. And I got some pierogies so that we could have it with our sour cream. And then I bought some ranch dressing because I wanted to make some chicken wraps um, with uh, some, some of that shredded chicken that I already made. And I'm making my homemade tortillas right now actually, so we'll be having that tonight. And then these were some really good deals on chicken. I got drumsticks, um, legs, and with the backs attached, and then also some thighs. These ones were five twenty-six, and I got these ones for four forty-six, and then these ones for six seventy-nine. So just over fifteen dollars for all of this chicken. I do buy a lot of chicken because it's one of the cheapest meats that you can buy. And that is everything that I got for $60. And again, some of this stuff, a lot of it is stuff I don't normally buy. But because I've been so under budget this month, I decided I would splurge a little bit. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video. And I look forward to seeing you all in the next one. Thank you so much for watching. And hope you all have a free day and a free weekend. Bye.